Well, I, I would say India has to uh, playing at home. You know, they know the conditions. They're very familiar with 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 the ground. They know they've got the crowd behind them. Um, but in saying that, uh, South Africa are a good team, and on their day, they can really put it together. I think if they can put a good score on the board, let that scoreboard pressure count, and then bowl well to the Indians, they'll they'll have a chance. So, uh, probably five, maybe ten percent um, more chance that India has in, in my books. It's not a lot, but uh, in, in big tight games, it, it does count for something. Well, they're better, or else they're not going to. They, they might as well go home, isn't it? So. Um, it is. I, I think. I think they can. They can put a score on the board. Um, they can defend it. You know. Um, but certainly, they better start. They better believe that they can beat India. And in fact, everybody better believe that. You know. Otherwise, their mouths will go home. But certainly, I mean, there is there is pressure on India as well. Um, you know. And saying that South Africa can they beat them? Well, of course they can beat them. There's a lot of pressure on India, and um, you know they have a little wobble up front. Or lose a couple of wickets in a in a hurry, you know they'll they'll feel the heat as well. They'll feel the heat of the crowd, um, so they've got a lot to play for as well. It's going to be very tight. It's going to be a good game tomorrow. No, I don't think so. I think um, in particular the game against the Netherlands. Um, I think India were frustrated early on where they didn't get wickets, and Netherlands got off to a sound start, but um, India weren't really be able, weren't able to pick up those wickets that, that maybe they had hoped. So for them, maybe that little period was frustrating. But all in all, I think it was a good workout for them, good workout for their batters. Um, everyone, pretty much everybody, got a hit that that bats up in the front, and um, you know, in the end, winning with 14 overs to go, it's, it's solid enough. It's uh, it really is just a good workout. Just get everybody out in the field, get the bowlers. Chowla, um, balsam overs, just just get some confidence really. He's not going to learn anything in those 10 overs, but he might just get a little bit of confidence and, and, and really that's that's what it was. Um, Yuvraj Singh certainly is, has done well as, as well. You know, there were questions asked about Yuvraj and um, you know, he's, he's kind of answered those and, and he's playing well and if Yuvraj Singh is playing well for India, the team will play better. Well, I think their, their fourth and fifth and sixth bowler is is, is probably where the questions are. There's no questions about their batting. They've got the ability to score big. Um, and as soon as there's questions about those, those couple of bowlers, then you don't really know what's a good score. You know, what can we really defend on a good wicket? Um, and then that poses a, a problem for the batters, is that how hard do we go or, you know, how far do we need to, to take this so that we can defend it? Um, and and um, really that is, is a question. So, yes, there's maybe a problem in the batting, but that puts in the bowling rather, but that puts a little bit of pressure on the batting because you don't know what's a good score then. Um, so, so, so maybe that, there might be a little bit of um, indecision as to do we need 300 or is 280 enough? Look, we've had our chances in the past, you know, um, and we've had our strengths, but certainly this team seems to, seems to have some very good batters up front and then it's got a wicket-taking spinner in, in Imran Tahir and two of probably the best seamers in the world in, in, in Morkel and Stain. So, yes, it is quite well balanced. It's a little bit untested in the middle, lower order in terms of batting, but um, if we can get off to a good start where our batters up front put the runs on the board, then we're going to give ourselves a good chance to win games. Well, he's, a, he's been around for a long time, Imran. He's, he's played all over the world. Um, and he's someone that, that can bowl the tail out. And that's invaluable, really, in one-day cricket when, when 9, 10 and 11 get to the wicket. Um, they don't really have much clue when a good leg spinner is bowling well. And that's, that's really what he does bring. He is a wicket taker, which is nice. In the past, we've had spinners that kind of just defend and, and hold tight, which has been great. But uh, certainly Imran Tahir is someone who can, who can take wickets and he cleans up the tail. He can finish an innings off for you. You don't get those extra 20, 30 runs that leak towards the end of an innings. It, it, just, it just reinforced the questions that were there. You know, we, we'd got off to a reasonably good start, looked like we were cruising, and then we lost a whole bunch of wickets. And, 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 and we did that against India as well in, in, in Durban when, when India were there last time. Um, we just couldn't really get that kick on from the, middle, from the middle stages. And that's exactly what happened against England. So there are questions there. Let's just hope going forward that team management and the players can, can realise that and then make sure that we don't do the same mistakes again. Well, you know, I think in the past they've kind of... Um, kind of been quite open, you know, there's a couple of guys that, that can do it. Um, 
you know, for certain, I'm, I'm, I'm not 100% sure as to, as to who can actually take over. Maybe a guy like A.B. de Villiers is somebody who plays permanently in the test and one-day team, and his place isn't really in question. So maybe he's a, he's a candidate, but certainly it's, it's not cut and dry as to who's going to take over from, from, from Graham Smith. It's a tough one for selectors, and it's a, it's a very important uh, um, decision that they need to make as to who they're going to go with. Because I think it's important that the guy they do choose is, is, is definitely a certain in, in both forms of the game.